What is up guys? Welcome back to the Lumsden Motorsports Garage. I'm Wade Lumsden and uh, today I did a little bit of work um, in the garage so I'll show you that. Alright, so um, this week I am actually going to be traveling for work. Uh, I actually fly out tonight, like in a couple hours, um, headed, down, uh, headed down to Mexico for a little while, for, actually, for a whole week, but I did uh, manage to wire up and plumb up the compressor most of the way. Um, I got my, my extension cord going up and over and I only made it to that far and then I just kind of let it sit over the top. I still got to get that stuff mounted up there. Uh, but it comes over and it's all wired up. And then I got some stuff plumbed in, my regulator dryer over there. Um, and then I think I showed you in a past video, but I got my drop down here and then it goes across the top and drops down. Um, so that'll be nice. I got air in the garage I won't have to worry about you know taking my little bitty compressor that's on its last leg anyways that I kind of patched together um, taking it in and out of the trailer uh, I have one now that's in the garage and it's yay uh, <laughs> so that's ready to rock and roll but uh, yeah I'm headed down to Mexico for the week for work um, I might show you um, a little bit of that I can't really show you what I'm um, what I'm actually doing for work but you know maybe crossing the border and stuff like that I might I might be able to do that uh, but wanted to give you guys an update there um, and uh, actually since I think I'm gonna try to do that um, I'll uh, I want to give you guys an update as to kind of what my uh, plans are here in the near future, but uh, I'll wait until because um, like I said, I gotta um, Get ready to go fly out. I still I actually still have to go pack my bags. So I'm um, gonna go pack go to the airport and I'll probably uh, come back to you guys um, When I'm already gone, so <sighs> on to the next scene <clears throat> All right, well guys I am uh, I guess I'm a liar and a fat mouth. Uh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't get the opportunity to pull my camera out uh, going across the border. I. Uh, that was a long story short. Uh, I had to walk to the border from the hotel that I was staying at, and um, basically we we walked in, walked to the wrong place, and extended our walk by, you know, over double. And uh, it kind of, uh, uh, I'm not going to say I got lost going to the border, but we did go to the wrong place and it made it kind of crazy. But um, I'm currently hanging out uh, in my hotel room, um, following up with some work stuff uh, after being in Tijuana all day. Um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't really get a... A uh, chance to pull my camera out because it was uh, go 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 since early this morning. Um, it's currently seven thirty, and I just got back uh, to the hotel. So um, I'm gonna do my best to get a video out to you guys. <clears throat> um, I did want to take a chance to uh, kind of talk about um, what I think future plans are here for um, the upcoming race season. Uh, I just briefly so what I like to do is um, I go to uh, Microsoft publisher um, and I print out a calendar and I make a monthly calendar and uh, I with that calendar I find as many race schedules as I can and I just start just start adding dates um, writing down where they're at um, when they're running um, so I can try to come up with uh, my race schedule. Um, 
granted right now it being December there's still some uh, some tracks um, that are in the local area you know they don't get their schedules out until you know February whatever uh, partially because they're dealing with like fairgrounds and things like that so they have to wait until they're basically told when they're allowed to race um, so I'm gonna show you what I got but uh, don't think that this is the complete schedule um, and I have not 100% picked what races I'm gonna go to um, here in January though um, up here January 1st is Stockton they race uh, they race New Year's Day I think I might I think I'm gonna try my best to go to that, um, but we'll see. I'm not 100% sure, um, but I, I think I'd like to. Um, I got to get a body on the car, and you know, a couple other things. But I think I'd like to do that. Um, and then uh, Coca Paws racing, but that's all the way down in Arizona, um, and it's these two weeks here. I don't financially um, and vacation wise, I I don't think I can pull that off. Um, looking at th everything in the long term because you know practice days the day before um, whereas there's the Vegas race XR putting on a race down in Vegas it's open modifieds which kind of puts me at a disadvantage being IMCA I think the other <clears throat> modifieds have better tires and stuff uh, than my G60 but uh, Vegas is racing uh, and since I registered early enough it was a free free entry fee so zero dollars to enter to go race down there uh, i just got to pay for my pit pass and stuff so um and it's closer it's uh, yeah, towing my trailer and stuff it's about seven hours seven and a half hours whatever um normally like in a car it's like six hours or something away uh so it's closer <clears throat> i think i can i can make that work out i think i'm going to be outclassed by other open modifieds that are there um but I might, don't quote me, but I might try to do that. Plus, it's kind of a cool cool deal. A couple weeks later, they're doing another one called the uh, the Working Man's uh, Race. Um, it's basically the same deal um, as uh, the January race. I registered early enough to where I didn't have to pay anything. This one, if you show up with an open trailer, you can double your winnings. Um, if you're the highest placing car that showed up on an open trailer, that's kind of cool. Um, Bakersfield has a race here. Uh, don't know if I'm going to make those. I was just trying to find some races that were, you know, January, February time frame because... I want to go race, you know. <laughs> um, I didn't have anything in the month of, month of March, but uh, that's April is when things kind of really start to take off locally. Um, you can see like Winnemucca, Battle Mountain, Love Lock, Rattlesnake Raceway, and Fallon, Elko. Like you can see that there are races pretty much every single weekend. Uh, within you know with basically within my state uh, which are I kind of consider all of these my local tracks my home track is rattlesnake of course uh, so I'll probably do everything I can to hit those um, octane fest we got the tough truck that's got to go to octane fest you know um, the high desert classic Ooh, I think they made it a three-day show this year which is kind of cool um, but you can see that there is plenty of opportunity to uh, go racing like a madman. I don't know uh, financially what I'm gonna be be able to cover um, as far as going racing and stuff. And um, I'm not chasing points this year. I'm not chasing. I might go for a championship at my local track again. Um, I don't know yet. Uh, but I kind of just want to go race. You know, uh, go have fun. Um, Super Nationals, of course, is in September. I think it's the second week. It usually always is the first, or yeah, it's usually always this like second week of uh, September, and uh, you know October, and then you, you go into November, and of course, the, I think Duel in the Desert's usually always the week of um, Veterans Day, so um, which is, again is in Vegas. So we'll see. Um, not 100% sure, but as far as near future plans, um, I'm thinking Stockton uh, and possibly Vegas. So, um, 
wanting to keep you guys up to date with that. Um, I do have my giveaway stuff ready to go. Um, I will do that when I get home. I will be traveling all of this week. Um, currently I'm in, I, I flew down to San Diego. I walked over into Tijuana um, and did some business over there. Uh, came back over to the San Diego side. Um, I'm still relatively close to the border. But uh, came back over to the San Diego side. Um, tomorrow, uh, I catch a plane and I'm going down to Guadalajara, Mexico for <clears throat> the rest of the week, pretty much. And then I come back home. So um, work travel makes it tough to get things done on race cars. But, you know, got to do it. Uh, got to do what you got to do. Um, I was lucky enough to be able to postpone this work trip until uh, after race season and a couple other things um, so you know got to do the things I said I was going to do <laughs> um, anyways yeah I don't don't think I'm uh, I'm traveling like crazy and going on vacation or anything this is this is all for work so um, gots to pay the bills man gots to pay the bills I got race fuel to buy methanol right so all right, guys. Um, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I'll keep you up to date uh, as much as I possibly can. Um, again, I'm gonna. I brought the GoPro. I'm gonna do everything I can to try to get some some footage while I'm down here. Uh, but I make no promises because I'm in work mode, uh, not in play mode. Um, and when I'm in work mode, I'm not paid to make GoPro videos for my YouTube channel. So. Um, I have to respect that I got a job to do, right? So um, hopefully uh, hopefully I'll get some stuff in my free time um, other than just going back, back to the hotel and passing out. <laughs> so um, we will uh, chat with you later, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, we do got lots of racing stuff coming up. Um, we're going to start hitting the, the car and stuff pretty hard. Um, and uh, like I said, if we're going to... We're gonna go race in Stockton, man. That's like three weeks away. Let me look at your calendar. It's January, or it's January. It's December sixth right now. So that's one, two, three. Yeah, three weeks, four weeks, three weeks, three and a half weeks, something like that away. Um, which will give me only a couple weeks to get things figured out. Plus the Christmas holidays in there. Got a deal deal with all that um you know holiday season so yeah don't forget to like and subscribe thanks for watching guys sorry not a whole lot of racing related footage going on but maybe that'll give you an idea of how uh how to do a calendar i guess um and how i come up with my my start of how i come up with my season i guess uh, there's a lot more that goes into it uh how i decide where what goes where of course financials and all that other stuff but all right i'm gonna quit babbling we'll talk to you later guys thanks for watching